Inside Tam Nagar, Prince William and Princess Kate's secret Scottish cottage revealed. Prince William, Princess Kate and their three children Prince George, 11, Princess Charlotte, 9, and Prince Louis, 6 are currently staying at Balmoral. However, while most of the royal family are staying in the colossal 52-bedroom castle, the Prince and Princess of Wales are residing in a cottage known as Tam Nagar, which was gifted to William by his late great-grandmother, the Queen Mother. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. The Wales family currently split most of their time between Adelaide Cottage in Windsor, and Anmore Hall, their country home on the King's Sandringham estate in Norfolk. But Tam Nagar holds particularly happy memories for Princess Kate and Prince William, a spot they visited often when they were dating. Prince William and Princess Kate, who met while they were students at St Andrews in the early noughties, spent a lot of time together at Tam Nagar away from the prying eyes of the public. During the young couple's university breaks, they would head to the cottage to spend time in the country away from the paparazzi. Although Princess Kate was taken to Tam Nagar in the early years of their relationship, it was not until 2009 that she went to Balmoral on an official visit for the infamous Balmoral test. The princess evidently passed the test as the couple were engaged soon after. The three-bedroom house is nestled on the 50,000-acre Balmoral estate and surrounded by greenery making it the perfect location to enjoy peace and quiet. The property is also close to another summer royal residence, King Charles's Burke Hall, which lies along the River Mick, and is where the King and Queen are currently in residence. Both the countryside and Scotland hold a special place in the Prince of Wales's heart, as he told Country Life in 2018, there is nowhere I feel more relaxed, energized and at peace than the British countryside. Of course, a big part of me is also in Scotland, my family has deep connections there and it was such a fun part of my childhood and upbringing. The Princess of Wales reportedly became tense after realizing that she was in constant competition with Meghan Markle. Prince Harry discussed his sister-in-law in his memoir Spare and shared how he believed she felt towards his wife, as reported by the Mirror. He wrote that the 42-year-old found it difficult to be constantly compared to Meghan, who officially joined the royal family in 2018. The royal reflected on a past appearance at the Royal Foundation Forum, writing, days later, controversy. Something about Meg showing support for hashtag Me Too, and Kate not showing support, via their outfits. I think that was the gist, though who can say? It wasn't real. But I think that it had Kate on edge, while putting her and everyone else on notice that she was now going to be compared to, and forced to compete with, Meg. Sharing in his new book Catherine, The Princess of Wales, the biography, author Robert Jobson shared that Harry previously had a close relationship with his sister-in-law but this soon changed when Meghan came into his life. The author wrote, ever since they first met, Catherine had always enjoyed a close relationship with her brother-in-law. When Meghan came into his life, however, the dynamic of the relationship changed. As well as discussing Meghan's strained relationship with Kate, Harry documented some old memories with his beloved sister-in-law. Sharing details of the early days when Prince William began dating Kate, Harry shared their close bond, however he also added details of the tensions that arose around his wedding to Meghan. Prince Harry began dating Meghan back in 2016, with their relationship made public the following year. The pair got married in May 2018, and welcomed their first child, a son named Archie in 2019. Their second child, a daughter named Lilibet was born in 2021.